Everything but to change my mic position. <laughs> Light is on! Welcome and welcome back to the stream, everyone. This is Wiwa. This is Wiwa. We're back. We're back to streaming. <laughs> We're back to streaming today. We're gonna be doing the Jessica event. Art Knight, let's go! Hello, my, my, my birthday was yesterday. Two days ago, can you wish me a belated birthday? Have a belated mm. birthday! Oh my goodness! Have a belated birthday! I hope you had a great birthday. If you have not, today's your birthday. Okay? If not, today's your birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> I officially announced that you're born. You're actually born two days later. <laughs> Yeah, anyways, everyone, we have a PC version and the mobile version of the stream today. So if you are on your phone and you would prefer to watch in like, you know, vertical, we have the vertical version of the stream available. Um, I don't know how it's gonna work. With Arc Knights, you're gonna probably see a big me and a small screen. I don't know, but we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> but hello, everyone. Wait, is is the is the vertical one working? It is, right? It is, right? So they are two versions. Yes, they are actually two versions. If you are um wait, you know what? I'm gonna share the link in the chat right now. Um This is the mobile version. And then this is the PC version. And yes, the chat in between um, the PC version and the phone version is separated because uh, of how YouTube works. Yeah. <laughs> so, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. how's everyone? How's everyone? Have you guys been doing good? Let me tell you guys. I worked so hard on Monday, and you guys know what I did yesterday? You guys know what I did yesterday? I started out a project Zomboid World that has no zombies and went looting for hours. Like, by hours, I mean, from morning to night. <laughs> Literally from morning to night. No, it's like it's like I've fallen into the Zen mode, you know. Like I'm just there sitting. I'm just there sitting and I'm just looting. That's it. That's it. Hmm. Project Zombie without zombies? How? What? Why not? Like like um um you could just uh, do the settings. Yeah, you could set it so that the zombies don't spawn at all. <laughs> It's pretty cool though, you know, like it, it gives you a really chill vibe If you if you like, you know building houses or just you know looting in general Well, you will enjoy that because I generally I genuinely do you know I don't have to constantly be afraid of someone getting disturbed by something when I loot or when I you know get attacked when I am moving something to The thingy All right. All right. All right Today we're actually playing Arc Knight, so let's get into that. Arc Knights, Arc Knights. Um, this one. Wait, I didn't set up anything. Wait, I didn't set up anything. Wait, wait, guys, wait. Mm. Oh my full screen. There you go. Okay. 
Okay, it's working, right? For both sides? Okay, it's working. It's working. Great, great, great. <laughs> great. Alright, I'm gonna slap you on the work so we're gonna lurk. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good, uh, good luck on your work. Good luck on your work. Oh, uh, really? Uh, it feels it feels so good to just not do anything yesterday, <laughs> but also at the same time, I'm feeling a lot of guilt from not for not completing my song cover, because it's like I wanted to post it this week, but I think I can't at the same time. So it's like, eh. I new event. I have not seen anything at all. I didn't. I have not clicked into the event. I have not did anything. Haven't heard of the music yet. Music sounds so super cool so far. How's the volume, by the way? How's the volume of the game? Should I make it louder? If you guys want. You guys need it to be louder. Or is this Daijoubu? And this music is actually a little bit lit. It's actually kind of lit. Full shot. What does she do? She's fine? Okay, okay, okay. Alright, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to destroy them. I don't know since I always put the shoe at full volume. Alright, story time. Story time. They say there's gonna be another attack in about half an hour. You want some water? Never mind. Look how tense you are. You just throw up anyway. Brief. Brief. Relax. Where are you up from? Girl? Columbia, huh? Ever heard of Davistown? No? Mm. That's a shame. It's a pretty neat place. Its route takes around the eastern forest, and the winters are long and cold. But its blade is home to a mine. Keep its core energy tower burning the whole time. Just the heat generated from that keeps everyone warm all winter. It can get pretty hot indoors, but it's also cold outside. So no matter where you go, as soon as you open the door, you get puffs of white steam gushing out towards you, which condenses on your eyelashes like teardrops. You have to wipe them off quick or the kids inside will laugh at you. But that's okay. That's when you fight back. Lift them by the armpits and toss them into the thick snow drifts outside. <laughs> TLDR, do not throw children! Everyone, just in case anyone, um, you know, have the wrong idea, do not throw children. I believe that is illegal. <laughs> now you get to laugh at all the snow on their faces. Oh. Pique your interest? Yeah. It's a great place. Everyone wants to go see it for themselves. And I... <laughs> you what? I really want to go back to have a look too. Man, you you you, you could feel that, that's one thing that I really like about the stories in Arc Knights. Like you, you could you could feel it. Like just by the words, you could feel how much this person wanted to go home. Man, makes me want to go home too. Hi, Oksan. <sighs> How is it so damn cold here? I don't get it. How the hell does this even happen? So goddamn cold. <laughs> Where's some clothes, Oksan? Get your ass inside them. If you know it's cold, why are you complaining it about it with the door open? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? And then there's calcite on her monologues. Mm. I don't want to get the floor dirty. Ah, the new up. Mm, look at her. She's so beautiful. 
You say that like you wipe your feet on the snow. Here, hot tea. Ooh, that's hot. The floor's pretty dirty in the diner today, huh? If I'd known, I would've just walked in. <laughs> We've got some heavy snow. Every time someone steps inside, it just gets dirty again. I'll clean it up after closing. <laughs> Damn it, YouTube quit doubling my message. YouTube doesn't like you. Mm. So, what are you having? Beans? Bread? <laughs> Stands in the snow, why is it so cold? Yeah, I know, right? Osan, I wonder why it's cold. What kind of choice is that? Well, it's all we have. If you'd rather have nothing, suit yourself. Can I get a little of both? Fine. Seeing how you're my first customer without a few scores loose, I'll even throw in a scoop of butter on the house. Helena. No what? Why do you have mud on your chairs? Hey, you two. This ain't your home. Put your feet down! Oh no. You talking to us, old man? <laughs> Settle down, you two. You stay out of this. <laughs> oh no. Don't be like that. Everyone's here for a hot meal. No to get physical. Hey, why are you taking this side? <laughs> oh, because I'd rather not see every little... Quarrel in the string ended a knife fight. Okay, I I I I am reading, and you know the, the the word like reading the word undeniably attracts me to to the fies, and I really want to compliment the artist. You really did a great job. She's so beautiful. <laughs> Shut up! We're on knife you two. Oh, come on, please. Please be 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 more be more civilized, be more civilized. For the love of, I I guess you want to see God. Stay out of this, Hona. I'll teach those hoodlums a lesson. Hey, your funeral. The ruffian takes his knife and steps forward, only for a dinner knife to fly at him from the opposite side and embed, embed itself in the ground near his feet. You. Not another inch, boy. It's late. Go home to your mommy. Right back at you, woman! Oh no, come on. Before he can take another step, a second knife brushes past his cheek and lunges itself to the wall behind him. A few drops of fresh blood drips to the ground. My, my ear! Stop whining, it's still attached. But I can't promise it'll stay. That the way. Blah, I can't promise that it'll stay that way unless you scram. Now. Yeah, go away. Uh, uh, uh. If the restaurant's proprietor turns around and takes Claude off, off the rack to start wiping the bar. Good thing Lila is reading a story because I skipped most part of it. <laughs> Don't worry, we're, we're, we're reading it today. There's another knife wedged in between her fingers. Shoot! Forget it. Let's go. We can get him back for this later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Get out of here. Here, your meal. Thanks. Yo, Chizan. Come on. You just complained. It's cold. We give you hot meal. What do you want, Osan? You're about the only person who burned his tongue twice in a visit. Hey, I was starving. Having I had a good meal all day. Anyhow, don't you think we've been getting more and more of these thugs in town? Probably because Woodrow's out searching for Miles, so they think nobody's gonna stop them. Hmm. Miles sure now to know how to beat a pain in the neck. He left the plate without a word to look for fuel, only to disappear without a trace. And now Woodrow's gonna look for him. What choice did he have? We don't have enough fuel to go around. Besides, it doesn't matter what he ran into, he can deal with anything. Man or beast, three seconds flat. But what if Redrow's too late? Alright, enough yapping. Finish your bean stew. <sighs> I'm just worried. 
Here! It's my last bit of buddy. Now shut your trap, will you? Okay. Kids, you awake? There may be ambushes in the forest. The Reckon team has gone ahead to scout the area. And if they need any fire support, we can't just be napping the transport. So get off your butts, pick up your gear, cover yourselves, on the count of three. Three to one! No, three zero. Ah! <laughs> uh, flashbang! What's wrong? Where's the glare from the snow? Fraga! She's so pretty as well. I'm pretty sure I gave you a reminder of what to look out for when fighting in snowfield. Where are your sunglasses? <laughs> Guess I didn't think it true. Whatever. I have to make do with what I have on hand. Hard things looking up ahead. Patience! The situation is a little tricky right now. The snow's too fake, so it's hard to spot any enemies in hiding. It'll take some time to pinpoint their location. <sighs> this was supposed to be a power plant repair job, and now we gotta clear up bandits too? Well, guess I'll just think of it as charity work. What do you say, kids? Ready to go! I love how... They are like the BS operators. Like, like actual BS operators, you know, like bullshit operators. <laughs> actual... <laughs> BS. <laughs> Seems my lackeys can't wait anymore, Captain. Can we get in touch with the Davis Town officers? They say that they'll send someone to meet us at the entrance to the plate, but there's not much they can do in the way of combat support outside. Wow, such hospitality. Good to know that I won't be getting lost in town at any rate. It's nearly bankrupt mining platform. We can't ask too much of them. They reported a power plant explosion and subsequent fuel leakage to the state government at the start of the year. But nobody cared. All things considered, they've dealt with it pretty well. So the pollution hasn't spread much. But the plant itself is almost beyond repair. Certainly more that the locals can handle. Hold up, hold up. The start of the year? How come they're only contacting us now? You think... Tiny municipality has the budget for that? They've never spent a dime until they're out of options. Uh. Imagine joining a security company just to be called as BS operators F for them. I'm pretty sure when they named Blackstill, they had the BS joke in mind. Okay, definitely. At the time, the plan could still barely support the platform's movements. A few months ago, it stopped working entirely. Now, I doubt it can provide its most basic function, heating. That's minus 14 degrees here. And colder at night. So it's all bad news or... Based on the map, Davis Town's just up ahead. You should see it as soon as you get out of the woods. Anything more exciting? Perfect timing. We've located all our targets. You can start clearing them out. <laughs> Great! One last thing before I hop to it. Where are Jessica? Where, where are Jessica and Laura? We send them somewhere. The enemy camp. There's a local being held captive there without too many guards. It wasn't a good idea to send off, to send too big of a force. Okay, gotcha. I'll clean this up. Ass up. Ass up. Hey, we've been hanging you here for an hour, old man. You thirsty? Need a sip of water? Oh no! <laughs> yeah, sucks to be you, Mal! Sucks to be you! <laughs> if you ain't sending anything, that means yes, right? Here, have as much as you want. No need to thank you. Oh god. Oh no! Don't torture the baby. Don't don't throw out the children. Don't torture your elders. 
Please, let me go. I have nothing on me. What are you saying? It's so boring out here in the snow and we finally run into you. Been a while since I had some fun. Enough messing around. I'd like some peace and quiet. So hurry up, hurry up and deal with him. You hear that, old man? You're so loud. You're bordering my buddy here. We gotta shut you up. Oh, God, please. Ugh. Oh, no. Don't torture your elders. Everyone else is ambushing the caravan, and we're stuck here guarding the camp. And when they get back, they'll be loaded with loot, and we'll have to settle the scraps. You telling me you're okay with that? If you aren't going to, I'll take care of it myself. Well, what are you gonna do? Oh no. Da da. Da da. Da 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 da. Oh. Mm. Who's there? Whoa. Who. Who are you? Shh. Quiet. She's so cute. Like, look at her. Like, look at the little mousy. <laughs> I love her charms. I love this. I would. I want one of these. I want one of these on my back. That would be super cool. That would be so cute, actually. Do 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 do. Okay. This is Laura. I've secured the hostage. Hard things on your hand. All done, but... Are you hurt? No. But my comms broke. It's fine, I can deal with it. Thanks. Okay. No need to thank me. Okay. <laughs> I'll take the hostage to... Rendezvous point. Ugh, I can't English. Man. This reminds me of how how fast I usually I usually um read the thing. I usually just like if I don't read it out, I just click 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 because that's just how fast I read and then it usually doesn't take this long for me to read the story. I'm taking you with me. Coming at me head on, you're one brave fellow. That was the last one. Reporting in captain, all targets neutralized. Okay, we're getting ready to leave too. Should be rend. How do you even read this thing? Rend. Then this. R what? Rendezvous. Wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me, let me, let me. Rendezvous. It's rendezvous. <laughs> yeah, what? So. The pain is fast waiting, especially when the game comes with voiceover. I know, right? Like, especially in like, like Honkai Star Rail, I have so much pain reading in Genshin and Honkai Star, especially in Honkai Star because you can't skip. Like, you can't skip, but I read very fast. So it's like, ugh, please, let me continue. Stop stopping me from reading. <laughs> hey, hello? What's happening there? Oh, let's go! No need for comms at this distance. You just had to come early, huh? Someone once tells me that playing pranks after combat can help elevate stress. <laughs> let me in! Let me in! Yeah, like, let me in! <laughs> You're getting better at this. I learned from the best. Mm-hmm. 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 The weather here is real temp... Temperamental, huh? It was all clear just earlier, but it's already starting to fog out. We've checked all the injuries, Mr. Mouse. The bruise on your abdomen doesn't seem serious, but I suggest you visit the hospital as soon as you can. H hospital? Davistown haven't had a hospital in a long, long time. Oh, uh, good. <laughs> Frank will be like, I don't care if I don't care if Davis Town has hospital or not. What are you what are you fox up to there? Relax, sir. We're dispatched here to help the plate restart its operations. We brought some fuel and some fuel and supplies. This should be enough for the residents to last until the power plant is, is repaired. 
But y'all bring any technicians? The plan was already on its last legs. Without technicians, the blasted weather will kill us the moment it goes out for good. Calm down, sir. I'm the lead technician on the team. Call me Lara. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I am. Um, I should. I should actually. <clears throat> you know what? You know what? You know what? I, I. I think I'm doing this a little bit too. To. To Chin Chai. <laughs> to. I, I'm making this too easy on myself. I should. I should actually start. You know, like. Like, let the voice acting voice act. Hmm. Uh, I'm Miles. A Davis Town boil, boiler worker. Thank you. Thank you. So, why'd you leave the plate? It's dangerous out here. We're almost, we're almost completely out of fuel. So I came out to try my luck. But if y'all are here to fix the plan, can we get going now? One second, let me ask Jessica where she is. Hey Jessica, it's Laura. You done there? Bzz. I'm all finished. Bzz. Then hurry up get, and get over here. Oh no, her comms died! Jessica! No, Jessica! Laura, where are you? I'll head over right now. Laura? Hello? Hello? Why did the communicator have to break down? Now out of all times, you know, you know who you should blame, Jessica? Blame the story writer. <laughs> blame the story writer right now. It's their fault. I swear. It's their fault. How come there isn't so much as a marker? Where am I? I'm not lost, am I? You are. You are, Jessica. Our beloved Jessica. You are lost. <sighs> calm down. Calm down. You're near David's town. You aren't far from the plate. I... I guess I'll have to wait for the wind to stop. <sighs> so cold. Jessica breathes a sigh and put her hand in her pocket. Her fingers spill the velvet pouch in her bag, as well as the small hard object inside. She takes out the pouch and pours out its contents. Nani, nani, nani. Our beloved Sag Cat. Yeah, just cat. Well, love just cat. We're pointing. You, huh? Captain Lazar encountered a windstorm on the way back and hasn't been able to return to the lunch ship. I'm standing in for her, for the for debriefing. Have we received Davis Town mission notice? Yes, sir. What about the details? Have we read it over yet? We will be having to Davis Town, a mining platform with a small residential area. The platform is currently stranded in the forest of Eastern Columbia due to a power plant explosion. Our mission is to repair the plant and restore the plate's mobility. Good. If I remember correctly, our supplies are issued today. What about the follow-up arrangements? That's all it said in our orders. Never mind. There's no harm in telling you. As soon as David Town returns to its original route, Fort Baron will be there to tow it to a nearby nomadic city for merging and salvage. Why are you telling me this? Jessica, ever since you got back to Victor from Victoria, you haven't been putting in as much effort as before. Sir, I'm not sure if that's a fair appraisal. I've been giving it all, my all in every mission, and have fulfilled every mission objective. Just last month, you refused an order to evacuate an air polluted with original dust. There was someone nearby who needed rescuing. Half a year ago, during the assault operation, you violated your superior's order and specifically chose a route away from the residential area. Your entire team almost caught up in an unnecessary battle. The original plan would have caused significant damage to the ro lo local residents. I... I... Such cat, you're, you're, you're too kind. A year ago, when you had returned from Victoria, you immediately charged into command center. If you had been carrying a firearm, I would have thought you were molting. Is that how you read that word? I don't know. <laughs> Good morning, hello, Malti. So, 
Sorry, sir. I wasn't able to control my emotions, but hundreds of Victorian citizens were. I understand your anger, but have you ever considered what would have happened if we hadn't evacuated as soon as possible? If a duke were to find out that the Black Steel, a Colombian company, was in the area? To the countries involved, this would have spanked a conflict. But to normal folks, we'd have called that a disaster. No, such cat. That doesn't make sense when you put it like that, but what does this have to do with our upcoming mission? I'm just trying to remind you to avoid making the same mistakes that you've made in Victoria. The, the same mistakes? Well, what do you mean exactly? She don't understand. She won't understand. It, it, it's just in her core, okay? That's why... I guess that's why um this um clip cliff guy would rather deal with Liskarm because like Liskarm is more is more rational and while you're at it take this pouch give what's inside to a man from Davistown named Woodrow Bianchi could you describe him at all like his feature or race no need you'll know who is the moment you see him sir I still don't understand it's just a power plant repair why let me remind you, Jessica. You're a mercenary. This is about business, not duty. Well, he has a point, okay? He has a point. Like, like, you're a mercenary, so you're supposed to, like, you know, do your job instead of, you know, trying to save... Trying to save everyone. Well, if, if you want to save everyone, just be a civil officer, right? Jessica picks up the bullet that fell from the pouch and holds it under the sunlight to examine it. Vim cartridge. Point forty-four. There's a pattern etched to the bottom. Mmm, it's too faint. I can't make it out. Sakta ammo. It looks pretty much like the etch ammo we used at Black Steel. The casing is rusted and the surface copper has brown. Even under direct sunlight, there's hardly any luster. <sighs> Jessica brings the sign and puts it back into the pouch. Make the same mistakes I made out of Victoria. What's going on in Davistown? Suddenly, she hears a sound that isn't a wind. Are we finally gonna fight? Don't move, girl. Not unless you want a bullet through the chest. Oh no, Jessica! Jessica! CV1 in a lonely place. Let's see. What is this? What is this event's um, thingy? I wonder. Let's see. Um, let's just build the normie team, I guess. I have no idea what's going on, so we'll get a normie team. Normie team. I doubt we'll need Typhon at all. This map is so small that I don't even think I need the lobsters. Uh, how many slots I still have? Three slots. What should I, who should I bring? You know what, whatever, we'll bring Typhon. Why am I th why am I even thinking so much? It's just it's just it's just the first level. We're gonna pass it regardless. <laughs> right? We're gonna pass it regardless, right? My headcanon for this event is developers getting sick of players spawn killing the enemies. <laughs> hmm. In a panic, Jessica reaches for the handgun on her waist, but fear keeps her fingers south of the top of the holster. Unable to bend. She smells of something vaguely rank upon the wind. Don't do anything rash now. <laughs> Jessica! From the thicket, a hunter walks into Jessica's line of sight, smoking gun in hand, with a white brimmed hat covering his eyes. Turns and look behind her to see a blood body of 
wild beast lying in the snow, blood still flowing from the wound on his head. You ought to keep your wits about you here. You are the Woodrow guy, ain't ya? Ain't ya? You're the Woodrow guy, ain't ya? Thank you for saving me. Just passing by. The elderly man stows gun and walks straight towards the beast body. He draws a knife and slices open his stomach. Clean and precise to keep the blood from spilling out. He then sticks both hands in the belly and lets out a long sigh. It's so damn cold around here. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, but are you a local hunter? Suppose so. Do you know how to get to Davis Town? The hell are you going there for? I'm meeting up with my teammates. You ain't alone? Well, my team split up to rescue a hostage from a bandit, but afterward, I broke my communicator and got lost in the woods. A hostage? Who? An elderly fort man. Didn't expect it to be you people. Alright then, follow me. Where are we going? Didn't you say you were heading for Davis Town? How the grind little love. We haven't started yet. We we're reading the story. Um, but don't say I didn't offer. The old man pays her no more heed. He stands up to sling the carcass over his shoulders and briskly walks deeper into the forest. Wait up! Okay. Hmm, you sure about leaving Jessica all alone out there? I know you're worried, and so am I. But after fighting by her side for so many years, I trust that she's perfectly ca capable of handling herself. I'm just worried that there are more bandits out there. A couple of stranglers, sure. But what if they got a whole band of reinforcement? Jessica's been through more worse than a bunch of thugs. What is just a rain of arrows whistling her past her scalp, blades thickening her throat, or surrounding choke with an active origin? Would they even sing a crack in her protective gear would be immediately evident. Each and every time, she completes a mission without our support and without the company's supervision. She may be on her own, but she never fails to del deliver the results. Uh-huh. I can't deny that. I'm sure you also know that she comes back every time with red swollen eyes. So before she returns, someone has to be there for her. When she's bawling her eyes out, right? <laughs> what do those puppy eyes mean? They mean that she's wiped her tears before coming to see us. She doesn't want anyone seeing her crying. Yeah, she's only 23. Yes, 23. And two and a half of those last three years have been spent on the battlefield. I, you know, like speaking of years, I wanted to ask who is the eldest, who is the eldest of um the whole Arknights universe, like like actually the usable operators. But then it's Calcit, right? Wasn't it? It was Calcit. But but what if it's like human years? Who is like the eldest one out of them all? If we don't count Calcit, because she's uh, like undead, right? She she won't die, right? Who's the eldest? Is it Heliger? It's probably Heliger, right? Because Heliger is like a like 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 like, like a like a vampire. Doctor? Really? Excuse me, didn't but did an explosion just go off nearby? Nope. I could swear I heard something. Pretty sure I wasn't imagining it. It was a tree, not an explosion. A tree? Ling or Kijira. Ling? Ling doesn't count, right? Cause... Cause like... How do you count the Sui siblings' age? How do you count the Sui siblings' age? Like, like... They... They are considered the same age, are they not? Or do you count when they... Actually get, you know, like, like, humanized? Like, they got their conscious? If it gets too cold in the forest, the sap and sun expands as it freezes, causing the trunk to burst. From a distance, it sounded 
a bit like a firefly. I don't know. I just based it on this story. Hmm. What are you? Soldier? Mercenary? I've been a mercenary for almost five years now. Family in debt or something? No, no, Mr. Woodrow. No, she is the richest person of our whole universe. Do family in debt, Jessica? <laughs> Never thought I'll, I'll see these two words together. Never thought that I would see these two words together. Exclude the gods, Kalsid, Doctor, Fristin, and other immortal beings, Heliger. Yeah, like, like, excluding all the things that don't die. <laughs> Heliger. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hold on. No? I just didn't want to be always sheltered by my family name. I don't want to follow the path that they laid out for me. So you want to become a Yes. Hmm. So what are you looking for on the battlefield? Fame? Fortune? Or glory? Mm. None of the above. I just want to eliminate crisis, resolve conflicts, and protect those in dangerous situations. No, Jessica, go be a civil officer. Go <laughs> go, go go be like a go be like a civil servant. That that's like or or go work in a charge. Hmm. So there are mercs who want to do that kind of stuff. Used to me. <laughs> Sir, we're no ordinary mercenary group. We're. Let me remind you, Jessica, you're a mercenary, not. Uh, it, this is about business, not duty. Yeah, Jessica, please, you gotta remember that. You gotta remember that. Alright, enough of that. Good me don't give me a whole spiel. <laughs> uh huh. Run! Dai suki na no wa. Sorry to bother you two, but are you talking about that seasoned missionary with five years of combat experience? <laughs> yeah, why? Got anything to add, Lara? You two have worked with Jessica a lot longer than me, so you've got a much better grasp of her abilities and limitations than I do, right? What, so you think she can handle it on her own? Of course, Captain Lissarm is, is right. She's been to far more dangerous places over the, the last three years. Well, I can't help but to worry when I think about the crybaby side of her. We all know she's going to be perfectly fine. Am I wrong? She doesn't know that. Yeah, she's the only one. But maybe she just needs a chance. One more chance to see her own worth. <laughs> And you're saying that this is your opportunity? Oh, uh, I wouldn't go that far. Hey. We would be spending the whole day reading stories instead of actually playing the levels. I kid you guys not. Sir, excuse me, sir. You're awfully noisy, young lady. No! Oh, I... I didn't mean to bother you, but... If you could, please take a look over there. Jessica points to a trap next to a tree in the distance. There, a big cup of forelings tightly clamped between the metal teeth. The cup winds as blood seeps out from the trap still wide. After the old hunter takes notice, he sets down the beast carcass, walks down the tree, unties the trap, and frees the cup. It's just a cub. Maybe you can let it go. If, if its mother is in the area, we could take a quick look around. Also, I hope that during the winter, hunters will often let mothers and cubs go so that packs can reproduce. Its mother is right here. Oh no! We killed the mom! No, not we. He killed the mom, not us. I've seen this female with her cows a few times before. Now, the mother's been shot to death. The cub stepped in some sloppily placed trap, so its pelt is all ruined. So, what can we do with it? Ring his neck, put it out of his misery. 
How could you say that? What else? It won't last long on a broken leg with no mother. You know, okay, in a in a really rational way, like 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 um like how I t tell you guys before, like I'm a very rational person, right? So I actually very much agree to the hunter. I, I very much agree to to the hunter's choice to just you know end end the cub's life and not let it suffer. Like this is the most humane way that you could do it because it definitely is not going to survive. Like, the baby is not gonna survive throughout the harsh winter with, like, no mother, right? Like, just put it out of misery. But... In, like, my my sensual part of me, you know, like, my... My emotional part of me is just there, like, but, 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 but that's... But it's just... You're just taking a chance away from the little baby. No. You wanna leave it here to die a slow death? You won't hear me complaining. Dark ones you mean. I wouldn't really call it dark. It's more like it's just too rational. And people... Some people don't like being too rational. And I totally understand that. Hmm. So, there's no way for it to survive? Nope. Could you please hand it to me then? You want to finish the job? Be my guest. No, it's gonna take care of it. It's gonna be all right, little fella. Everything will be all right. Jessica holds the cup in her arms and gently runs her finger down its fur. She doesn't do anything else. She patiently waits for the cup's wines to gradually fade away until they disappear completely. I couldn't save it, but at least I can let it go in a warm embrace. Ah, ah. Most people act on emotion, so rationality always seems to crawl. Mmm, true. Mercs do hospice care, right? That's not a first for me. It's just her, Woodrow, Mr. Woodrow. Do you mind if I live here? I think the mother is a good enough catch on its own. What, you want me to bury it for you two? Hold a funeral while we're at it? <laughs> no, animal is... Every animal in the forest is hungry during the winter. If we leave it here, maybe one of them can have a good meal. <laughs> I might be a bit of a softy, but... That doesn't mean I'm completely oblivious. If you get it, then try to keep it up, Miss Missionary. I'm guessing you don't want to get, lo get lost in the woods again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we still haven't even done... It's about an hour into the stream, guys. We haven't even done one level yet. The winds cleared the fog. Sir, did you bring us here just to get a view of Davistown? When I was little, I loved running to the high places near the plate, just to get a good look at the town that I lived in. What was it like back then? Livelier, more glamorous, more full of life. Mm -hmm. As for now, well, there's no going back. No turning back on the clock. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's freaking cold. Can't believe that they shipped us off to a place like this. Franca, what's in your mind? I was just thinking about Jessica again. What about her? Didn't you say you weren't worried? I was thinking about that opportunity that we were talking about. Oh, you mean the chance for her to see her own war? Who knows? Maybe one day it'll come to her in a gust of wind, a freaking cold one. So cold that it makes her shiver all over. But it'll sweep all... But it'll sweep away all the pocket before her eyes and everything will become as clear as day. I just hope that she sees... What she, I just hope that she... What she sees then won't be anything like what we're looking at. Mm-hmm. It's like, why'd you... Why make you set up a team when you were going through an hour plus of story before any gameplay? <laughs> Dial. Oh, I really like this art. Look at this. Like, like... Oh. Like, like, one thing that I really love about Ark Knights as well it is the art. I think they spent such a good job portraying the, the, the whole world. 
especially like um little like this is not a big site but you could tell just from here that this place had been glamorous before but it just like but it just broke down it just broke down like it's just not as pretty anymore like it just didn't you know there's like incompleted buildings there's like a lot of junk all over the place mm. at their end is an abandoned plate despite the distance everyone can clearly see an energy tower right in front of the middle of it <sighs> feebling whizzing out puffy white crafts so this is like the tower this is like a tower where where it generates the heat right like a dying patient struggling for air Are we finally gonna get in battle? We are. <laughs> Operation CV1 in a lonely place. Let's go. Congratulations to us. We're finally getting. Energy capacity? What? What, 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 what energy capacity? No, 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 no. Nani, nani, nani. What, what is this? What is this energy capacity thing? What, what is this? What, what is this energy capacity thing? I don't understand. Should I try spawn canning something just, just to see what happens? <laughs> Should I try to just to see what happens? I don't know. Oh, what is this? Increase the rest of your surrounding enemies. Okay. Rest, huh? Okay. So that was like planes. Okay. We can actually make it without without blue poison. I actually I actually am treed my my blue poison. Like she was my first five star. Um, she was actually the five star that I started with. Wait, what is this? Deals art damage. Explodes upon death, causing enemies on the field to gain one energy. This sounds like something that would need, um... This sounds like something that would require... Lapland. Is it? Yay! More story time after two after less than two minutes of battles. You know what the energy capacity does in the next level, if I recall. It'll be fine. Hmm. Ugh, Helena, ain't it way too cold in here today? Every day is cold. We're almost out of charcoal. Have so have to save some for later. <laughs> just burn that mountain of bills piling out of my place. The bank just gotta send more anyhow. <laughs> Did you catch coal? Come on, let's swing around my place to grab a stack of that waste paper. Why do you think I'm coughing? Not in front of her. Oh, if it ain't Sylvia. Hi, you're beautiful. Oh, is she is she the bank person? Good good morning, Mr. Fairman. What brings someone from the bank out here to our shabby little embushment? Something wrong? So sorry. Next battle gonna be on part two of the stream. Really? Really? Is it gonna be that long? Oh, Leon, I hadn't seen Benny in a while. What's that kid up been up to? Busy with studies. Got his nose in a book till dawn every night. Then the school closed down a little while ago. Our neighbor, Miss Selena, used to be a school teacher. 
She reckons it'll be a real shame for Betty to miss out all that book learning. So she's been letting him study at her place. Huh. Good friend. Betty's always been a smart kid, and he was real shook when he learned he wouldn't be able to go to school no more. Yeah, he was so anxious that whole year. Miss Mr. Fairman, actually I I could teach Benny too. Alright, you graduated from the best business school in Colombia. Um What's he supposed to learn from you? How to become a banker so you could bury people in bills too when he grows up? You know, I understand the hatred towards like, you know, capitalism from this man. But it's a little bit unfair to the girl because she's only doing her job, you know, like she's only doing her job. Don't don't rant, don't vent your anger on her. Leon, eat your damn breakfast before it freezes over. Hmm. I I need to get to work, so I'll be leaving now. I'll leave the money on the table. Bye-bye. You know she ain't give it. You know she ain't responsible for any of the loans here in Davistown, right? What are you giving her a lift for, right? Yeah, she's just... Come on, don't, don't... Like, don't, don't do that. Like, yeah, there might be a rat in... There might be a rat in the warehouse, but it doesn't mean that all of the rice is bro... It, it's like rotten. I mean, our this event story has been getting longer and longer. I, I ain't complaining, you know. Then let her have heart, heart to heart with the others. They'll be even harsher, I guarantee it. But still, we watch her grow up. That's exactly why it pisses me off even more. <sighs> Sorry to keep you waiting, ma'am. I hope you're not too late. Oh, hello. It's fine, you're not late at all. Or would you like me to call you? You can call me, um... Uh, sure. How long have you been standing here, ma'am? Since this morning. The message only said you'd be arriving today, but not the specific time. But it's already afternoon. You've been standing here the whole time? Yes. Three hours ago, we sent a notification to the plate, updating them on our estimated arrival time. I didn't get anything of the sort. That's weird. Who sent you? Um, the manager. Manager? It's not a title I'm used to hearing in the government. Actually, I'm not from the government. I work for a local bank. Since when is a bank in charge of this? Actually, Davis Town is. We here, Captain Lissarm. Is this woman here the one in charge of our reception? Wait, Sylvia? They send you here out for this? That's right, sir. Hey, old man. Any idea why the government sent a banker to pick us up instead? <sighs> You best, you best ask the bank directly. I'm sure it ain't gonna be explained all the twists and turns. Alright then, Franca, go ahead to take the gentleman home. And while you're at it, take a walk around Davis Town to get a better grasp of the situation here. Oh, Mac, thank you so much for the super chat! Thank you so much for the super chat! Wait, I can like the super chat. Let me like the super chat. Like. I wanna like the super chat. Like this? Like the super chat. <laughs> this was for the for the for the super chat. Really appreciate it. Understood. Lara, bring the others with you and find a good place for a safe house where we can securely store our supplies and vehicles. If you manage to get a hold of Jessica, report to me right away. I got it. Demista. Silva and I will head to the bag to find out what exactly is going on here. That's our teacher's pet for you. Thanks for volunteering for the hard part. <laughs> you know, like that. This is the part that I really, that I really, um, that I am really, uh, res that I really respect 
less comfort because she knows what her teammates are good at and she lets them do what they want and she herself however takes on you know the leading role and does what she might not enjoy but she still does it because you know it's her job mm. Papipa! Hello! Just wanted to give the super chat to you before I had to bed. Hope you're liking it. Thank you so much! Hope you had a nice... Uh, hope you had a nice sleep later. Where should we regroup once we're all finished? Y'all can meet up at the only diner still open in town. It's right by the only road to the mine. Run by a real nice lady named Helena. And if this Jessica of yours finds her way to town, I reckon that's where she'll end up to. Hmm, it's decided then. I really like the scrum. The bank is right up ahead, miss. People here have been avoiding this whole way here. Had I known, I'd have asked Franca to take my equipment back with her first. No, that's not why. Oof. You... You... <laughs> you run into someone and don't even apologize? It's over. Sir, are you okay? It's all over. What? What happened? Do you recognize him, Sylvia? No, I... um. Let's head to the bank first. What? What's going on here? Along with the rapid development of pioneer settlements, nomadic plates, both large and small, has also been springing up. I got so confused and pushed the skip button on the whole screen. <laughs> yeah, click this button. Press left click right now, everyone. Left click right now. Yeah, left click. Your, your cursor is right here. Left click. <laughs> No way, that, that just happened, right? No way. No way that just happened. Really? Why do I really? <laughs> but at the same time, very few financial institutions in Colombia were specialized in pioneering. After looking deeply, into the living conditions of countless pioneers on the frontier's edge, our founder decided to plant his roots alongside them and establish the first bank to provide practical financial support to the lower and middle classes. He prided himself in building trust, showing kindness, and doing his best to provide attentive service to everyone who walked through his, his doors in the rough and tumble frontier. It wasn't long before his hard works and empathy won him wide recognition. Then, we begin forming close and fruitful partnerships with local governments, working together with mining and pioneering companies to help them flourish and expand rapidly into settlements, just like in Dave's town. Quite the legend, wouldn't you agree? And who might you be? Sorry for keeping you waiting, Miss Lascarm. I'm the bank's manager. My sincerest apologies for not being able to welcome you in person earlier. We are aware of the problems facing Davistown. A few inconveniences here are to be expected. However, no need to reserve. Feel free to speak on your mind. We're planning to liaison with the local government, not a bank. What exactly happened to the government here? Sylvia, did you not explain the situation? Measure, I... Sylvia stood alone in the cold for a better part of the day. If you ask me, what she needs right now is a hot water and a blanket. Of course, Sylvia. Take half of a day off to go home and get some rest. Okay, I'll see you later then, miss. I'm eating too, so I got confused a little. <laughs> oh, so... Miss Lascarm, if there's anything else you need, please let me know. Resources are scarce on display, but we'll do everything in our power to accommodate you. I appreciate the sentiment, but please don't try to change the subject. Why is it that Black Seal's client was the local government? But we're being 
being greeted by your bank's employees. We are the heads of the local government agencies. Please come with me. Mm -hmm. Warehouse? You guys gonna kidnap Liskarm? Are you telling me that your government's officials are in the bank's garage? During last year's bankruptcy liquidation, local governments cut most of their department and laid most of their employees. But that wasn't enough to pay off the massive debts they still held. In the end, the remaining government buildings were put up for auction as well. What about the mayor then? Where is he? Unfortunately, after the last mayor ran off with hardly a penny to his name, the Townville never found a suitable candidate to replace him. What? So this town has no mayor? Has no government? As you can see, all that remains today is the mayor's secretary and a few temporary employees. <sighs> it's okay. If the bank hadn't generously provided us with free office space, we'd be out in the streets. It's just the right thing to do. Besides, it's nothing compared to what you have been through. Seeing as the government still functions, can we... No! I mean, as much as we'd like to help you, we simply don't have the manpower to support your work. Then who's the one in charge of, of our work here? We've been giving full authority over to the woman standing next to you. Go to her for anything that you might need. Absolutely. My door is always open. I certainly hope that you can issue a formal document showing this authorization. Mr. Secretary, when can she expect that document? I'll have it ready right away. The official seal somehow went missing yesterday, so I've sent someone to go look for it. Thank you. Now then, I'm very much looking forward to a mutually beneficial partnership. I'll show you to my office. Try not to dawdle, as we have many things to discuss before our work begin in earnest. Wait, just a moment, ma'am. What is it now? Um, well, it's been way too cool in here recently. Would you mind turning up the heat in the garage a smidge? Everyone's freezing down here. Of course, I'll always do my best to accommodate your needs. She's not gonna do it, ain't she? She's gonna be like, oh yeah, I forgot. Have you and your teammates decided on... Um, a red blah, blah, blah. I still don't know how to read the word. Um, not yet, but it'll be fine. I'll find somewhere here to wait for them on my own. Yeah. There's a diner here in Davis Town. Wait in there. Where is it? Um, um, don't you need? You don't need to take me there. General directions should be fine. Forget it. Just come with me. <laughs> he knows. He knows. He knows. You. You know. You know. In, in the in the Osan mind, he's like, yeah, this. She's gonna... She's gonna get lost for sure. So let me just send her there just in case that, you know, I see her on the streets like two hours later. <laughs> What's going on with this guy? Huh? Is she one of the plate's residents? That man... Why does he not have anything with him? Excuse me, sir. Where are you going? Hello? Are you leaving the plate? It's not safe out there. Over here! I'm talking to you! Look! Over here! Can you hear me? Sir! Sir! OG! Thank you so much for the super chat! The man does not respond to Jessica calls and simply continues shuffling towards the snow in silence. Papipa! Papipa! In front of him, the vast light stretches far into the distance, blending into the dark, ashen sky. <laughs> From Jessica's perspective, the vast snowfield gradually squeezes the man into a pale blue line. After a short while, he shrinks into a small dot, then finally disappears into the white. Nothing remains to prove that he was even there, save for the tracks that he left behind. Are you coming or not? I'll be right there. 
Go, go, go. Thank you so much for the super chat. They're finally gonna meet up. Just cat. I'm back, Helena. Woody? About time. Wait, where's Mouse? He was rescued by this girl's friends. Um, and who are you? Um, um... She's a mer She's a mercenary that I met on the way. Her communicator broke and she got separated from her teammates, so I brought her into town to wait for them. Mind if I take a look at the communicator? I might be able to fix it up for you. Ooh, Hine, you're such a nice person. See, he's nice. He's just... He's just a bit... Eh. <laughs> no problem. You guys save Mouse. What's So what's a little communicator in between friends? Let's say, why come here of all place? Receive a commission from the local government to help Davistown restore it, its power facilities to and get the plate back on its navigation route. Hold on, girl. Could you repeat that? Restore our power facilities? Ain't pulling my leg, aren't you? You just see the goofy grind on your face. Young lady, regardless of why you and your companions are here, thank you so much for rescuing Miles. I've been so worried. I ain't sleeping in the wing for days. Alright. Oh, all's well that it ends well. Then got anything to eat? Then have nothing ready, but looks like you brought something back for me. Alright. A mother base? Sorry, it is my fault. No use fighting over something like that. This time of year, nothing beats me. Fair enough. Okay, you two, sit your butts down and grab something to drink. I'll prepare the mead. Hey, why are you getting up to leave? Weren't you gonna eat? Change your plans. Sir, how badly damaged is the communicator? Nothing serious. Come on, let's go take a look around my warehouse. Might be some spare parts that we can use. Stop tinkering around with this try. Deep fried? No, this is the good stuff. Deep fried! Mm. I had some fried... I tried frying some chicken yesterday. Mm. But... This definitely ain't enough for everyone. If you're worried about that, then stop scarfing it all down. Poor gold still ain't had a piece. <laughs> it's totally fine. He helped me fix my communicator, so he deserves to eat his fill. That barely counts for anything. It's so cool around this part, so we gotta help each other out just to get by. Give us a whole lot if you ever need it. Thank you. I appreciate it, ma'am. Aw, they're so nice. By the way, I happen to see someone a ways out from the plate. He wasn't carrying anything and wouldn't respond when I called out to him. He just kept walking deeper and deeper in the snow until I couldn't see him anymore. Did something happen to him? You're a guest here, young lady. Don't worry your pretty little head over stuff like that and just feel your tummy first, okay? Then, would you mind if I asked you two about someone else? <laughs> Kids this day Barely stepped on the plate and already so many questions Alright, fine, ask away I want to know about the man named Woodrow Bianchi Who? Sorry, I guess you're not familiar with him I'll try asking someone else No, that ain't a problem You sure you not confused? Woodrow's the man you, who brought you here, though <laughs> Jessica, you have never asked for his name, Jessica. You have never asked for his name. Isn't it like, isn't it like a like a polite thing to ask for someone's name? You know, like like just ask for the names. Oh, tutorial. There ain't gonna be any stories in tutorial, right? There ain't gonna be any stories in tutorial, is it? Is it? Is it gonna be any stories in the tutorial? No, there's not. Oh my god, that's the tutorial! What is this? Wait. 
Jet cooling. Restores 2 SP upon attack. Activation effect. Deals 200 damage per second to all friendly and ground enemies in units for 10 seconds and actually sh slows the movement of enemies 70% and causes them to gain one energy. Okay. Let's go check out this old fashioned waste heat bed. Look, I'm warming it up. It really is heating up from the energy of the attacks, Franca. We need to collect more data on local equipment and enemies' future operations. Oh, it gets. Oh. It. Okay. Whoa! What is this? It just go. <laughs> when the wasted run reaches critical temperatures, it'll actively dissipate the accumulated heat in a straight line in front of it, dealing continuous arc damage to all units and slowing enemies within this range. But the emitted heat will also charge the enemy's heat, amplifying equipment and gradually increasing their attack and defend as their energy charges up. Okay. Let's get a medic of on our operation as soon as possible. Okay. Animals will enter an overload state once fully charged and greatly increasing their. Okay. There's no way that they can maintain that state for long, so I'll take on the, all of the attacks, okay? Thunderstorm! Seems like they lose all their energy when the overload runs out. Animals with no energy will lose all their attack and defense up, so it's the best time to strike back. Operator Jessica here to provide support. Go, go, just cat. Go, go, just cat. Go, go, just a cat. Okay. So you zap them, they fill up their energy, and, and they die. Something like that. Okay, let's see, where is it? How am I supposed to hit it then? It's blocked off. Is it not? Oh, this is such a ifrit. This is such a ifrit place. This this line here. We could bring an ifrit, and then someone here probably. This is a good thorns place. Ifrit. Mm. <laughs> Okay. Let's see. Well, there are people who don't want to give you the name. I mean, not wanting to give and not asking is one thing. Like, like she didn't, she didn't ask at all. Like, isn't it like a, like, like, like a courtesy to like, you know, uh, ask people their names, you know, like, or, or like, what, how do you refer them by? But she didn't, she didn't ask. What? <laughs> yeah, just can. Hey, Jessica, where are you going? I need to go find him. Jessica? Uh, Franca? Laura? What are you doing here? Reporting in unconfirmed Jessica lo location. She was in fact at said diner and her lips are currently covered in oil. <laughs> Guess that she's been getting acquainted with, <laughs> with the menu. <laughs> I love the way that she said that. Uh, I love the way that she said that. Understood. I'm just about finished on my end as well. <laughs> I lips are covered in oil. Uh, took you long enough, TG's pet. We're starving out here. It was hard to find this place. It's in the middle of nowhere. Well, whatever. Let's just find something to tide us over.
Miss, I'm extremely grateful that you brought Mouse home. But if you're gonna complain about my cooking, that's a different matter. Complain? What's there to complain about this weather? Isn't that right, Lara? Of course, it's absolutely delicious. Better than anything my mom or grandma ever made, that's for sure. Good to hear that there are still folks out there who appreciate the craft. So, what do they do for a living, sweetie? Are they cooks? Um, my mom's a doctor and my grandma's an engineer. Wakaru! <laughs> Neither of them know their way around the kitchen, so my dad's the one who did all the cooking. <laughs> Enjoying that a little bit too much. Oh, easy there. I'm eating. You see, I'm eating. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Do you have anything to drink? I like a glass of water. Sure thing. Just a moment. Picking up a random empty glass on the table, the restaurant owner throws open a window and scoops out a couple of thick snow. Give it a bit to melt and then it'll be drinkable. What really? Wait, no, no. I, I, I I'm curious. Okay, I. Do you... Can you really drink snow? Like, can you actually drink snow water? Can you actually drink snow water? Like, like for real, like, I'm asking this, like, genuinely, because... Based on my knowledge... Based on my knowledge of all of these, like, you know... Based on my knowledge... You are... Not supposed to drink snow water right right are you <laughs> not the typical asian dream job family yeah laura is the perfect um is the most beautiful asian template technically yes just like river it cares or risk hmm true by the way captain did you ever find out when we met up from someone in a bank the government here is barely functional and doesn't have the capacity to, in to interface with us. So they left the matter entirely to the bank. They left it to... Who? Well, what did the folks at the bank say? It roughly boils down to two things. First, we'll have their full support. And second, the details will be discussed at a later date. Sounds like we got the work cut out for us. But you're not the type to come here to eat your sorrows away, right? They're lacking in supplies and manpower, but they do have money. Money is the one thing that we're not short on, though. That said, assuming the bank keeps their work, what do you think about hiring a few of the locals? Ever since the plow plant incident, most of the people on display have chosen to leave. It's hard to say how many able-bodied workers are they left. That explains how few lights are on outside. It's barely 8 o'clock. To be honest, we don't need that, much pe that many people either. I can handle the repair work with just my team. What we really need is someone with deep understanding of the situation in the energy tower. Is the bank offering any good candidates? Nope. About that. <laughs> offering self. I was so busy fixing up your communicator that I forgot to introduce myself. The name is Leon Thurman, the blast engineer from the local mine. Pleased to meet you. A blast engineer for the mine? Why are you still here after all this time? <laughs> A few of several old forests refused to leave. I've been in this mine since I was four. We don't know how to live anywhere else. When the plant first started having problems back then, I took a team down there to deal with it. Though we never managed to fix it entirely, we did get it up and running for a while. I'm impressed. It's still working to this day. Eh, that's all in the past now. Nothing worth mentioning. But how would I be paid for this exactly? Oh, that. The commission is supposed to be completed as soon as possible, so we're not paid per dime. The only required room and board expenses are covered. After the plan's repaired, we'll be paid in a lump sum. The faster we get it done, the bigger the reward. Of course, we can also offer you a portion of the payment in advance in the interest of cooperation. And how much are we talking here? You will be treated as a consultant. If we can get the job done in two months, you'll get 40,000 in a month, twice in that, in a week, Twice a nugget again? A bit more than that. You'll be able to earn yourself a solid 200 grand. Ooh, 200 grand? Deal. Didn't even think twice, huh? 
I ain't turning down 200 yen. No one's gonna turn... No one's gonna turn down 200 grand, okay? Sure, but where would you ever spend that kind of cash here? Depends on how old you are. For a young guy, 200 grand is enough to eat, drink, and play to your heart's content. But when you're my age, it's just another drop in a bucket called debt. Debt? Are you in debt? Not just me. Everyone here is left with debt. How do I put this? Well, I'll just give it to you straight. You asked about the guy who walked out to the snowfield earlier, right? It's probably because of his debt. That kind of stuff's happened here all the time. After being forced into bankruptcy, he had no choice but to. It's too late. It's not your fault, Jessica. <clears throat> so, Lara, is there anything that you would like to discuss with Mr. Thurman? Alright, come back here tomorrow to meet up with her, sir. If you have any materials, bring them with you too. Alright, no problems. I know a few miners too. They can also... That won't be necessary. You're enough. Don't be like that. Can't hurt to recruit a few more. Put yourself in our shoes. All the able-bodied folks are gone. And the only people left are old folks like me. Well. Thanks for coming to see me, Benny. I'll be fine enough, so head on home. Stay out any later, and Leon's gonna be worried sick about you again. I still haven't finished my writing exercises. Besides, I don't want to go home. That is... Mm, never mind. I know Leon's got a bit of temper, but even after all these years, his feelings for you have never... I understand all that, but... <sighs> you warm enough? Should I throw in a few more locks in the fire? Don't worry, it's fine. By the way, about those people who brought you home. Was that the same Black Steel squad that rescued you? Yup. They're here to help us fix the energy tower. When it's all up and running and the heat's working again, we won't even need this fireplace. But even if the tower can be fixed up, that doesn't mean the plate will ever come back to life. You're gonna go bald early if you keep worrying about crap like that. Yeah! Like, like... Like... Uh, that does this one... One... One thing that I hear from people saying is that, um... Children only need to worry about what they're gonna study tonight. And what they're gonna be playing tomorrow. And all the other stuff should be worried by the adults. And if you're a kid and you're worrying about that, it means the adults are not doing their job properly. <laughs> that for sure. Someone has to worry about it because that sure <laughs> because that sure won't. And Paul's gonna too. There was Kyle, but now he's gone too. Benny. Mouse, are you there, Mouse? Thank goodness. I found us a great job. We can fix up the power plant and make piles of cash while we're at it. Dad? What are you doing here? Oh. You here, Benny? Well, you can stay up and keep studying. I need to take Miles to go meet those black little girls. I already met them. They're the ones who rescued me. Ah, uh, me and my memory. Did you already ask the others? I asked all over town. They either already gone, getting ready to leave, or have given up altogether. You and I are the only ones who's still willing to put in the work on that plant. Ah. Uh. The safe house isn't expected to be completely ready for use until tomorrow night, so we'll be establishing this as our temporary. That point. That point. It's become relevant because I have no idea how to read the word. Laura, so tomorrow the engineering team will be under your command. We must restore this plate's mobility as soon as possible. No problem. As for Franca and Jessica, I have some odd jobs for the two of you. I need one person to come with me to play to pay the bank another visit. And another needs to head to the outskirts of the plate to make security assessment. Employees from the bank have said that bandit the bandits occasionally come from out there. Can I volunteer to head to the outskirts? Sure, why not? Which means I'll be going with all this karma to just... Here to see just how big of a headache this bank people are gonna be. Mm -hmm. Everyone, please note that while most of the power is basically saved due to the active originum dust settling down over a period of time, there's still areas where in index exceeds standard values. I've already synced your devices with... 
the specific danger zones. This will be a hard repair as the tower is still in operation, albeit at low output. So please pay attention to your personal safety and report any accidents as soon as possible. Well, Roger, Dad! Thanks, you two. You save us a lot of time poking around at danger zones one by one. I've worked here for most of my life, but place more of my home than a creepy room in the underpass. Then sorry in advance for making a bit of mess. <laughs> Wouldn't have it any other way. Fire? <sighs> it's so badly damaged, but it's still burning. It's practically a miracle. Mouse and I have reinforced the furnace a few years back, both to prevent accidents and let and to let it burn things other than arsenic fuel. <laughs> First time in a winter like this, truck, we still had some leftover arsenic products lying around. But later, we were lucky to have wood to burn. As for now, all we can do is assess the situation. Team A is in place. Everyone else, report your location and status. We'll begin diagnosis in one minute. Team B in place. Worst visual inspection shows approximately 30% damage to the combined cycle unit. Team C in place. The cooling system is completely wrecked, but since it's so cold outside, we can throw together a makeshift air cooling system. Team D in place. The ash discharging air conduct is operating normally. We'll adjust our pace depending on the other team's name. Well done, everyone. Let's get to work. Captain, I've arrived at the last patrol point. Any signs of bandits along the way? No, I drove all the way out here without seeing anything. Frank and I will be entering the talks with Ben shortly. Be careful. If you encounter any problem, contact us immediately. Don't worry about inconveniencing us. Do you understand? Roger that. Yeah, we're finally going to fight. Hello said would roll often passes by here after hunting. I don't know if I'll be able to meet him today. Mm hmm Why does it smell like pine oil here? Oh? Pine branches? Did someone start a fire? Someone's been through here, but who? Could it be Woodrow coming back to the play? Oh? She's gonna find some bandits, isn't she? Oh, never mind, she found a guy. Woodrow, wait for me! Oh. Someone else is back there. Woodrow, watch out! Oh. Who's there? You brought more bad news. What? Are you okay? What are you doing here? Sir, there might be bandits roaming around the area. You should head back to safety on the plate as soon as you can. Mm, why do you look so... Mean? You sure know how to be the pain in the rear. But that man behind you is trying to snipe you. I came here to save you. You have any idea how hard it was to lure that guy out? And now, all that evidence is down the drain thanks to your bullet. Oh no. Oh no, sorry. I... Are you investigating something? Maybe I can help you somehow to make up for it. Okay, now that you know that there are bandits out there, ever thought about what they might be after? Probably looting supplies and stuff getting by around here? We can barely keep ourselves fed and cloth on the plate. You think they want our scraps? Their motive out there is to... Their main objective is to ambush and rob caravans. Well then... What are they after here? Lately, a bunch of people from the plate has gone missing. And my witness tell me some of them have been seen talking to bandits here before they vanish. So my question to you is this, what are you doing here? I was assigned to maintain security along the plane's outskirts to ensure that any bandits wandering around the perimeter and don't interfere with the power plant's repair. All on your lonesome? No, I have teammates. Besides, aren't you also here? Whatever. Bye. No, Jessica, you keep forgetting what you're supposed to do. Jessica. 
the first thing that you should do next time is just stuff it in his hand. I'd be like, yeah, here, this is for you. That's it. Did they all make it in time? Did they all make it in time? No, I won't. I won't. Wait, 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 wait. I don't want to leak this. No. <laughs> Come on. I leak. Ifrit, you suck. Ifrit. Ifrit, you suck. Ifrit, you suck. Ifrit! Where should I put? I'm gonna put... I'm gonna put here. ミッション剣を見せるは規律。ずるずるずる。地獄の方が。いつでもいけるぜ。オッケー。もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、もう、も
Just messing with you. I once blew that much money on a little project and black steel though. Totally not worth it, by the way. Stop dreaming, girl, and get back to work. Hi. Oh yeah, thank you for the new subscriber as well. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the channel, this is Viola. And just so you know, old timer, count yourself lucky when you can hear the Laura go off on her random bots. Her mind's always racing while she's working, so it means she's talking nonsense as a way to release the pressure. If she suddenly stops, it means. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I I could I could feel like it. It means what? It means the problem's too big and her brain's short circuiting. <laughs> mm. Okay, everyone, listen closely. Stop whatever you're doing and leave the energy tower back the way you came. Hurry. I mean now. Uh oh. It's gonna collapse, isn't it? It is gonna collapse. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, bye. Sylvia, can you finish up processing the bank statement before 9 tonight? No problem. Then I'll leave you to it. Okay. Uh, how long has the manager been talking with this dude? The situation, the account does not look very optimistic. That's not my score of action. Blah, 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 blah. They're, 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 they're talking about the payment, isn't it? Wait, Liskarm, I heard, I think I heard something. A blackout? The energy tower? Sorry, something urgent came out. We need to confirm the situation first and explain things later. I don't mind. Go right ahead. Go, go, go! Oh, looks like the bat. The power is back up working. I was hoping we could clock out early because of the blackout. You won't even be able to clock out if it's the blackout, right? The, the clock out machine wouldn't even work. Well, unless it's like the, the old clock out where you just like write it or or, or the the punch holder. Is it? I've just had... I've just about had it with this damn place. No bars, no nightclubs, just a tiny diner. Serving barely edible soup. And now even the half dead energy tower isn't working anymore. Hey, Silva, why didn't your mother open up more restaurants when she was mayor? Did she lose the sense of taste or what? Sylvia? Oh, huh? did she slink away while the power was out? Uh huh. What? The blade! What's going on? Laura? Laura, did you copy? Laura? Oh no. Oh. Woodrill! Did something happen back in the town? I I don't know. But things don't look good, so I'm heading so I'm heading back. Give me a ride. Hi! We need to drive the man back to town. Where are you, Jessica? Captain Lissarm? I haven't been able to get in touch with Lara. What's going on over there? We were briefly able to make contact with her, but the signal is awful. All we know is the emergency occurred during the repairs, but she isn't in any immediate danger right now. But don't panic. Just worry about yourself and we'll meet up at Helena's diner. Understood? Got it. Okay. Can you make this thing go any faster? Sorry. Stop crying. I'm asking you to speed up. I'm not trying to bully you. Your captain has just told you that Laura is not in any danger. Gonna go now. Bye bye, Lobo. Thank you so much for dropping by. Hypothetically, if she really didn't have an accident, how would you rush over to help at all? I don't know. But I have to, we're partners, so if I'm not there for her, her who else is gonna be? Partner, huh? Oh. <laughs> you know, you know, it, it's like about two hours into the stream, so I, I, I'm kind of feeling like, should I just, should I just do the levels and watch the story later? <laughs> you know what, you know what, I'm gonna go read the story later. I wanna do the levels, I wanna do the levels. I'll read the thing, I'll read the thing when I'm done doing them. Giving up on reading the thing. Let's see. 
What do we have here? Definitely. Hmm. Hmm. likes giving us this sort of levels, huh? I will read it later. I just want to do the levels. I should have did the levels first before I before I actually hop in to read the story. Let's see. How should I do this? How should I do this? Victoria no bug pipe. Okay. You lost your mind? This should be fine! Right? This should be fine, right? Right, Thorns? I believe in you. I believe in you, Thorns. I believe in you, Thorns. Here. Here, Typhon. I believe in you. Okay. Yeah, this should be fine. We can just AFK now. We don't need so much. Ooh, there's two of them. <laughs> there's two of them this time. You know what? Let me. Oh, it just died. Oh, it just died very fast. Is there gonna be a lot of ifrit levels in this in this uh in the sea fan? I feel like there is for now. Let's see, what's this? Uh... Uh-huh. Oh, this is another Ifrit lane. This is another Ifrit lane. Why is there so many... Ifrit lanes today, huh? Okay, we can do one here. Or we could probably do Typhon here. We could probably do Typhon here to like snipe them. And start. Alright. I hope there isn't any range enemies. That would actually kill my people. There is. Mm. Let me think. Why am I getting DMs? Hmm? Oh, why am I getting DMs? What happened? Okay, never mind. Uh, let's see, how should I do this? Should I just let... Hey, Dosio. Should I just let Thorns take this lane or. No, I'll let, I'll let Thorns take the bottom. <laughs> no! Ifrit! Um, let's see. Ah! Should have picked the second. Should have picked the second skill. <laughs> oh, 
my poor Ifrit is gonna die. Stop hitting my Ifrit. <gasps> okay. We're fine. We're fine. お前の叫びなんて誰にも届かねえよ。ご指示。前に進む。いや、マイプレイ。ちっ。マイプレイ。あつゆに。じゃあ、ポイントオブハブリングスヒューラン。What's the point of having this here then? ちょっと出ていけ。え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え、え
I feel like there's gonna be some mechanic that involves like this this big guy. But I don't know. Is it is there gonna be some some mechanic involving this guy? Yeah, he kinda like it's like you're not supposed to kill this big guy. But whatever, whatever. We we can just brute force it. Oh, that's so much. Yeah, come at me. Mm. Mm. We snipe them. <laughs> I can just. My <laughs> 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 pawn is so strong. Nice. Good job, everyone. Good job! That wasn't very hard. That wasn't very hard. Huh? I wanna see what, what materials can we farm in this event as well. Or sugar. This one. Oh, let's see. I feel like they're gonna circle around this for like so long. This Hey, you guys know what this uh, reminds me of? This reminds me of um, one of the first Crown Slayer levels. Right? Does it not? It feels like one of those Crown Crown Slayer levels. No, 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 not, not Crown Slayer. Wait, was it Crown Slayer? Or is it the Skull Breaker? Was it called Skull Breaker? I forgot. But it was one of the earlier bosses one. There was like... Um, there was like uh, a couple of AoE casters around here. Reminds me of one of those levels. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. Actually, no, I'm not ready. But yeah, kind of. Let's see. Okay. Well, typically I'm just telling you about them. Taikichu. Jigoku no Goka. Itsu demo ikere ze. Motta koya wa. Honki de iku yo. Jikan o kakeru tsumori wa nai. Arigata. Okay. Can't spawn cam them. Uh, wait, how much are you lane? Five blocks. One, two, three, four, five. So it's this block. So I could technically do this. I'll charge for it. I'll wait for the thing to charge first then. Go, go, Ifrit! Good job, Ifrit! <laughs> Good job, Ifrit! You can do it! How's the rip off Skull Shutter is treating you? We're not there yet, no. I just started. I actually. I, I just started. Oh! Ah! It's the same person, no way! It's the Skull Shower! He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> there he is, he's dead. <laughs> 
That's my experience of it. Literally, is that that's a period. <laughs> Bitch. Yeah, we bully him. Okay. I should try to do a man version of um, clearing, like, man version of it. Mm. I got a medal? I got a medal? What medal did I get? What, what is the medal? Medal list. What is it? Well, not letting snipers go over what a two times. <laughs> he died as fast as he lived. I don't remember his story being this quick. Hmm. Oh, grindstone! Yes, please, grindstone! Thank you. I love grindstones. Okay, let's see. What do we have this time? Mm, no happy Ifrit. No happy Ifrit. But what is with this? We could put thorns here. Probably. Thorns here. And some healer facing down. Then I can probably put Typhon here. Hmm. Man, there's no happy E for Tal. Well, there is, but. Mm. Mm. Alright, let's go. Let's go! Let's see! What do you have this time? White Heat. It's. どうやらもう迷っている場合ではないようですね。出発しましょう。わ、ごちゃん、今日もよろしくね。There's so much charging happening right now. Oh, they started walking. I don't like this. It hurts. Um, let's see. Let me think. Let me think. Um, we could put Kagen was ジャージ中。ゴールはここまでだ。命令無駄だ。リンゴちゃん、今日もよろしくね。ありがとう、高校が荒川が無駄だ。うん。It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Guys, it hurts. Thank you. Oh my god. Yes, <laughs> no. stop. Yes, hey, stop. You're killing Thorny. Please stop. You're killing Thorny. Please. Stop murdering Thorny. Thorny has done nothing wrong to deserve this. Please. <laughs> Poor Thorny. I kind of want to redo the stage for a little bit so it clears a little bit faster. Like, I feel like 
I could do this a bit faster. And... Mm. Could do this a bit faster. I need uh, another couple of jobs. We could just kill everyone. We could just spawn kill everyone. I have an idea, guys. Trust me. It'll work. For real. Um, uh, we need... 27 <laughs> Please stay alive for a little bit longer あ、次に行った。じゃあ、全員の行動力を奪う。はい、よろしくお願いします。加減はしますよ。え、まとめて Here, the bottom side is actually okay. Like, that's like. Just like mountains, so the bottom side is okay. Oh, wait, I forgot about you. I forgot about you. Yeah, the bottom side should be fine. Them to walk in my yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, this is a lot faster. It's smoother, at least. Okay, let's see this one. What is this? This is I'm pretty sure this is where the boss comes, right? Where's the boss starting from? He's gonna walk... I think he's gonna... Is he gonna start from here? And then he's gonna like walk here? Probably? He's probably gonna go here. Then come out from here to the... To, to like this. Hmm. It's okay, we'll see. We'll see, it's not gonna be that hard. It's not gonna be that bad, right? Who's the boss even? Who's the boss even? <laughs> I forgot to change AI skill. But it should be fine. Are you... No, it's not Here, mountain, you spawn camera. Hmm. 
対処できるはず。No, I need more ground units, guys. I need more ground units. Ah, you are the boss. You. あなたの指示しっかりしてくださいほらまずは深呼吸してみて諦めるなうっ Don't attack my BP please 準備は整った指示を待つ今日は眠い場所ねこれでどうです I don't know, guys. I don't think it's a good idea to kill him so fast. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Oh, freak. What is this? I'm gonna clear the side first. It's a bit bad. Okay, 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 we're fine, we're fine, okay, okay. We're fine. <laughs> we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Um he's the last person, so I need him to hit somebody else first. Oh, go, go, Aya, go! Why is he teleporting? Why is he teleporting? Why is he teleporting? What is this mechanic? What is this mechanic? What is he teleporting? What? What? Why is he teleporting? What? Doctor, so many Mikan Shiva Yosanai. Why is he teleporting? What? Nani Mokamo Umaku Kiona Jin Senara. Bokta Chima Doryoksuru Diumo. Mine is a smoke and Doryokumo Nakanar de Shaw. Okay, we're, we're, we're changing strats, we're changing strats. Okay, Mountain, you go away. I need Milnar. Milnar, thank you very much for your contribution. Uh, I want to spawn cam him so I have more time. The first person dies, you're looking at Katarina and Arkna itself. Oh, come on. Please. I can't believe I just got Katarina in Arknight. I can't believe that that just happened to me. Oh, 
I should put Milner down first, actually. Oh, I'm gonna put Milner here. Mobs that are not that does not like take the normal damage. Here, BP help do a little bit of damage. Huh? Did I just click on Myrtle's skill when there's someone on her? Did I? I, I just did that. Oh my god. Lovely as well. To silent the boss kill unless he's on Is he silenceable? Is he silenceable? Immune to stun, immune to frozen. Oh, that means he's silenceable. Mm. I swear, I suck at this. Unfortunately, no. Wait. Is he si He's not silenceable? But he, it, didn't, it doesn't say here that he's not silenceable. It says he's immune to stun, immune to frozen, immune to levitate, immune to sleep. So he's so you can't silence him? Not using a guide and try to do something, and you be like, "Oh, what am I doing?" Doctor, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Taking damage. The, the left side is such a problem. If I put Thorns one block backwards, I could put Sara at the front. Or I could just use Hoshi because Hoshi is more picky. Ones, ah, oh, please. Easier to defend against those enemies, at least, at least one type of enemy. Okay. <laughs>
我が三つ子は何時に死をもたらさん I put Nova down I like him use his heal first Then I'll put Nona down Never mind, he didn't use his skill. Nuna is not surviving this. Smart, I'm not surviving this at all. What is What is this? He just keeps attacking faster and faster. I don't understand. What? My brain is not working for this one, guys. Help! The dash. I know, right? He just bursts at everyone. And he, the thing is, he stuns. That makes it worse because I can't, I can't do anything to a stun unless I use two. Unless I use two. Unless I use two. What is it called? Two tanks to clamp it in the middle and get and like you know. Just leave him here until he slowly dies. And I clear this side first and I kill him here. <gasps> but that's so painful. I don't want to do that. Doctor. Is it yeah, he's very tanky. Yeah, that's the thing as well. He's very tanky. It just makes it worse that he's so tanky. <sighs> Let me think. Yeah, the wave lock as well. Mm. I'm having problems with the last wave, first thing. If you burn the man with wind, he attack and defend goes down. Wait, really? Oh I need to block him. I need to block him here. It means The damage from my Aya. Uh, but my silver ash though. But my silver ash though. Hello, that's why I'm joining me so like hello Aru. I am suffering, mouthing, scratching my head on to the point that I think I, I am bald. Zain 
I forgot that it was this. I keep forget. <laughs> My brain is really not working right now because I I keep forgetting what's what skill I'm using, and I'm like, yeah, I'm using this right now, but no, I'm actually. Not. Screw this game. I hate this game. I hate this game. Helena! She's so pretty. She's so pretty and beautiful. Oh yeah, speaking of which, I wanna share I wanna share something. I actually had a bad dream yesterday. And you guys know what sort of bathroom it is? I dreamt that I spent 50 pulls in this... in this... 
in this banner. And I was like, no, why did I pull 50 pulls? I wanted to save it for my for the next banner. <laughs> and I remember I was, I was like, no, why did I do this? Am I stupid? <laughs> and when I woke up, I was like, oh, it's a dream. It's an actual dream. That Thank goodness it's only a dream. <laughs> Kid you guys not? I was I was on the verge of crying because <laughs> because of how much because of how much pools I get. Congress, it's really a hoarder, and I I have not I have not gotten such a scary dream in such a long time. This is even a scarier dream than, you know, like, zombie, zombie type of, um, of things. I'm saving it for Retrosa, yes. I'm, I'm actually saving for Scalter. And I hope I can also get Tech Salter in the banner as well. Yeah, so you could say that I'm aiming for Retrosa, Tech Salter, and Scalter. Your brain cautioning you before you could consciously pull. I don't want this to happen! No! I think you may have a gacha problem. No, this is not a gacha problem. This is my brain warning me to not do anything. To not do anything suspicious. Uh, this is my brain giving me warnings. Like, no, no, Lila, you're, you're not supposed to pull now. Mm. Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna... I'm gonna call it... I, I'm gonna call it here. Because it has been almost... Um, how long has it been? Oh, it's... Oh, it's 140 already? Yeah, so... Yeah, I'm gonna go rest. It's, I actually... um My... Monthly bloody week has just started literally like just now like just now as in like before this stream starts so i'm like in massive amount of pain right now um yeah so i'm gonna go rest for today thank you so much everyone for dropping by i really really appreciate it if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. I do games, I do singing, and I do yoga. And yeah, I'll see you guys um tonight for our My Hollow TV stream. We're all becoming small. Mm. We're all becoming small tonight. So yeah, I'll see you guys tonight. Bye bye. What uh, uh, I'm just gonna end the shorts first. End the short stream. End. Alright guys, I'll see you guys um on the My Whole TV stream. Or I'll see you guys tomorrow. There will be a membership stream. Well, it's just a data. It's gonna be a data stream. There are some stuff that I want to address, and there are some stuff that I want to talk about, and there's some stuff that I want to discuss with you guys and stuff. Hmm. I will see you guys soon. Bye bye.